Yo, how's it going everyone? Welcome to another episode of Cossacks 2 Battle for Europe. Today we're continuing as Prussia on very hard difficulty, and I'll actually have to change to Prussia, because that was on my skirmish profile, but we've got 29 out of 34 um, sectors, and this may just be the last episode, because all we have left is Egypt. So we have to do bang, 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 and then he'll probably forfeit, so... Let's go straight for it. In the last episode, I totally destroyed Spain. And I, I kept complaining how their guerrilla fighters only have 60 squads. 60 troops in a squad. So I spent a few hours just looking over the game files. Trying to wrap my head around how they work. And where I would have to change it. To see if I could change it myself back into 120 squads. 20 screw troops in a squad. And I've managed to find it. And I tested it, and now the guerrilla squads for Spain have 120 troops again. So, from this point on, they'll be back to normal. Because, I mean, the, the game is way, way too easy. When the AI only has 60 troops in a squad. And all, literally all you have to do is just walk up to them, shoot them, and they're dead. You know, so... Yeah, it's, it's a lot better the way it is right now. Where I, I changed it back. And this is how we're gonna play it, you know? I'll have a more fun time and it'll be more fun to watch because I won't just run through the AI, you know? But yeah, let's focus on this battle now. I didn't see, but I think we're only fighting six squads. I'll have, I have, I should have read it better. But I think we're only fighting six squads. And if we're not, then we're fighting 12, which either way is not that tough. I'll actually get one squad going here. Give me this mission done. For no reason at this point. I don't think the missions benefit us in any way. But yeah, we're fighting Egypt. So they have some really strong cavalry. These camels are actually really strong. Like, they have a lot of life. I'll have to check. They have like, yeah, 400 life. That's really good. I'll just shoot them. Yeah, but they make they make horse noises, so that's cool as well. Yeah, we just run into them, get these guys fighting them too, considering that they're being kind of wrapped in the middle of it. Yeah, we're all good here. I think these Egyptians are gonna start running back, so I'll just... Oh no, they're just gonna stand there, cool. Are they fully sat down? They're not, so they don't have defensive bonus, so I can attack them. I'll just shoot them here. Wow, that was a terrible shot. Garbage. Uh, anyway, let's conquer this. Let them reload. What's going on down here? Capture this. These dudes are being wrecked. I'll uh, move these guys to the middle, and these guys just stop over here. What is that noise? Oh location. my god. Okay, I need to capture this. Because it looks like my guys are being bombarded. Yeah, I know there's a ship there. I didn't expect it to shoot me, though. Quick! Get over there and save my troops! We've spotted the location of enemy troops. Yeah, we doing? How we doing? Okay, this is... I forgot what they're called, Soldiers but they actually shoot Janissary, enemy. yep. So need to be a little bit more aware of them. The enemy village. That being said, my troops are way stronger, and they're experienced, so... It's not much to worry about. Just moving on them. Nice one. I'll just keep village. chasing them. Yeah, this is gonna be a really quick fight, probably. I mean, I am just trying to uh, get to the fucking... What's the name? Just trying to get to Alexandria, you know, so... Shouldn't take too long. I'll literally just go in and stand in front of them, and I'll shoot when I get up to them. The foe has entered the firing range. The enemy's closed now. 
Okay. Advancing against the enemy village. We are repelling the enemy's cavalry attack. Yeah, I would just shoot them. The enemy village. Throw some grenades, and that's gonna be them done. Oh wow, they actually survived. The enemy has lost nice. the squad. I didn't realize my guys deal 53 damage, I would have just moved in and attacked them anyway. Because they have a bonus of 40, but that still means I deal 13 damage, so attack. still decent. How we doing up here? I'll just shoot him. Our squads have captured the village. Nice. Get rid of these guys. Start close fight. The foe has entered the firing range. We should be able to beat these archers, they deal 7 damage and I deal 70. We've captured the I thought they had infinite stamina. Tireless, but they got given stamina, okay. Well that's gonna be something I have to look into then, because I'm sure that was due to the patch as well. And I don't like that, I think they should be tireless, if that's what the game says, you know? The enemy is scattered. So after this episode I'll have a look into making them tireless. I don't think that ever impacted the playthrough really so it's not a big issue like you know it's not something that makes the playthroughs invalid or something because it greatly benefited me that they were tireless. but I will look into making them tireless again because it seems like that's how the game was meant to be played so We've crushed the enemy squad. but yeah let's kill these guys and I think that may just be it yeah quick note I like how we have like way too much food that it doesn't fall on the screen compared to when we fought in um, Budapest and we ran out of food twice so but yeah cool that was a quick fight it did seem like maybe there was 12 troops I don't know how many was there there was there was just six okay Cool, I'll end my turn. He wishes to surrender? No. Uh, I skipped turn. I need to capture Alexandria before he, before he can surrender. So let's fight 12 squads and then we'll move to Alexandria. I don't know why the AI just throws a fit and just decides, you know what, I'm not gonna attack anything. I'll just surrender. Because he does have troops. So I don't know why he doesn't just attack somewhere. But anyway... Just get guys to capture stuff. I'll actually We've make use of my horses. Move them over here. Move these guys to this village if I can, potentially. You guys can go capture this. Any other musketeers can go over here. And my main six good troops can camp here for a while until we get everything else settled down. Advancing against the enemy village. We've spotted the location yeah, of enemy troops. the AI is there straight away. I expected that to be the case. They have to start somewhere, and there's 12 of them, so... Okay. Oh, they have cannons! Okay, I did not know they would have cannons. I did not know the AI gets cannons at 12, um... Squad at 12 is squads. Is this a strong troop? This is a strong troop. Yeah, they're running away. Cool. Once my horses get here... Now the what's the hold up? Everyone's just village. going really slow. The enemy delivered a blow. But yeah, I'll just move in on these guys. Because they don't shoot, so they're gonna keep running away. They they do have better stamina than me, so I I know I won't um Approaching I can't I can't village. click on this. I will just get him here. Hello, Mexican standoff. Start close fight. I'll get those guys to go and. Oh, okay, they got stopped. <laughs> there we go. Now they can go and get the cannons for me, maybe. 
I'll have to make them walk around the Janissary, so they're gonna need a minute. We've spotted the location of enemy troops. Get the grenadiers in behind. I'll give this a second. Right, they shot me, so now I move in. We move in on the cannons. The enemy's close. We are under gunfire. Enemy gun obliterated. Yeah, I'll keep chasing. Seems like I haven't shot with them yet, so that's cool. I'll get the horses location. to charge in as well, because everyone's running away. Our squads have captured the village. How are we doing down here? I'll just go in and attack. The enemy squad is panic -stricken. I'll actually pause the them in front obliterated. if I can. And I'll do the, the thing where I shoot closing. right in their face. Enemy gun captured. We've obtained information about the enemy's location. Okay, I didn't do that much, but that's fine. Just keep them there. I'll the keep charging, actually. Now they only have 74 squads, so I'll get this guy to travel via road so he's not wasting stamina. Meanwhile, this Grandier troop can just go forward. These guys are facing the wrong way. What are you doing? The enemy's close. We can capture these villages. Well, we have a little breather. Yeah, see, because they're just gonna keep running back, so why not? We are under attack! Okay, I think that's this captured then. We've captured the nice. Bullet. Just get him to chill for a little bit. Yeah, we captured this. Nice. These guys can shoot again. How are we doing here? Nice. I'll keep him chasing. The foe's approaching. Approaching the enemy village. Yeah, their morale is too the low. Yeah, there we go. I think it's just these guys we're waiting on now. We are under gunfire. Get both these guys to just go in there, finish them off, I guess. Sixty-three damage. Let that sink in. The enemy squad is panic-stricken. That is insane. 63 damage. What the hell? Well, there you go. That fight was even shorter than the last. <laughs> Not enough to capture the village. How well? Right, and then we'll just move in on Alexandria to end the playthrough, I guess. We captured some cannons. Let's go, 17 against 24. Now because I, like I said earlier, I looked into the game code and tried to make it so that the Gorilla squads had under 20 troops, I think I may be able to make it now where like different troops have different numbers, like as in like I could make why, why can't they use the road? Okay. As in, I can make it like, for example, all the horse troops are a hundred squad, a hundred troops in a squad, you know, or something. Maybe. I'm not sure if I actually can, but I, I feel like I could maybe do that. So I'll have to look into it, cause that that could be like a fun playthrough idea where like the game isn't quite right, you know. There's there's some the weird thing. things done to it, like all the horses have hundred. 
troops and then or all this all the like soldier squads have only 30 troops or so you know it could be a fun idea so I'll have to I'll have to look into it but yeah it, it may be doable you know so don't know why they don't just use the road silly These guys are here, so I'll just move them in here, try and capture that. We, are under enemy we can move everyone else up, considering the AI is taking their time and they're not here yet. Just try and gain as much land as we can. Approaching the enemy village. We've spotted the location of enemy troops. The enemy's close. Yep. Okay, there we go. There's all the AI. So I'll plant. Oh, I can't. The game doesn't. There we go. Oh, this isn't finished. Oops. Our squads have captured the village. Plant them this way, and then plant these guys to face up the way. Approaching the enemy village. We shot them first, which is a fantastic advantage. I'll go in and try and destroy them, but they're really strong. Yeah, they're probably gonna get wrecked. I'll try and help my musketeers survive, but I'm pretty sure they're dead. Actually, the Mamluks aren't shooting, I don't know why. Yeah, I think we just managed to escape. I'll move my grenadiers in. What's going on up here? The enemy's closed now. Guys are getting wrecked. I need to uh, reposition everyone. Are being by the enemy cavalry. The enemy's closed now. Not gonna move those grenadiers in. No need. Their arrows took down two guys. That's quite amazing how little they did. Right, I'll move my horses up here. The enemy is not far away. They can help me out. Yeah, I'll keep pushing with this black core. And I'll push these guys this way. My other grenadiers can come down the here. Enemy's close now. The enemy's close. Because this black core squad deals so the much damage, the they should troops. be able to beat these guys. But then as soon as they beat them, I'll have to move them out. Because they'll be really, really weakened. One last troop remains guarding the enemy village. But yeah, they're winning it. The foe's approaching. Maybe? Are they gonna get wrecked? Our squad did fall. Oh well. That was a really good squad, but that's okay. We've obtained information about the enemy's location. Are they still chasing? The they are. Cool, just stop them here, because their morale. One Can I shoot those guys? Throw some nades at them? The nice. How are we doing up here? We've obtained information about the My dude's still fighting strong. Need to be careful here, because they only have 70 s troops in the, the squad. Has the firing range. Can maybe... Okay, the my horses decided to not take the road either. So... I'll just move them in. We can probably just rush in and destroy everyone. The enemy opened fire. Need to enemy be careful with this squad, so I'll move it out. Regroup. Enemy enemy okay, just go in. Yeah, they wasted their shot. So now I can shoot. Oh, that's two squads in one. They're stacking. Well, if they're stacking, I'm stacking. One single I wonder who won that. <laughs> Alright, who, how are we doing down here? Enemy is at Moving on those archers. Distance. I don't need to go too close. Just need to make sure I shoot. Yeah, I'll just shoot them. Their morale is really low. That's them done. The nice, let's go. Get these grenadiers to complete that mission, I guess. We are under enemy gunfire. Just need to 
just be careful here. Oh, nice. We got them before they could shoot me. Alright, who else we got then? Got these boyos. They're gonna just keep running away, I think. But this may be the last squad. Well, this wasn't a pretty fight, but they got the job done. Wow, look how much mail I have. Let's get all of that opened. Task accomplished. The enemy squad's defeated. Nice! I guess we won. Our motherland has been glorified. Well done, I guess. I mean, well that that was that was incredibly rushed. Um <laughs> probably the fastest battle for a capital ever. But I mean, what do you expect? <laughs> there we go. Nice. And I guess I'll just build this up a bit because why not? And their turn, and that's the game. There we go. And that's us won as Prussia with 39 victories. Let's just look through some stats before I end the video. So yeah, on sector, you can see that here we just start destroying. This is when like we start going after Russia, so we gained on Russia lost. So you can see you can see the issue is that no one wanted to fight. They didn't gain or lose sectors for so long. Ryan got defeated very quickly. Resources, I obviously popped off. As soon as I started taking Russian land, that's when like all my resources start going up. Yeah, there we go. Number of resources. Number of recruits, that's when I... I don't, don't know what happened there, but yeah. Power of army, I stayed stable pretty much the whole time. I guess that's because none of my troops died really. Maybe. I think that happens when I just destroy them, maybe? I'm not sure. Maybe that's when they surrendered. Power of Nation... Yeah, way too much experience. Enemy skilled? God damn. That's, that's good. I'm guessing these were the capital fights, right? Maybe. And if not capital fights, then like when generals were standing on stuff. Oh, Egypt took up big loss at some point jeez but yeah i mean that's our playthrough on prussia only took not that many episodes <laughs> less episodes than the other playthroughs i i did get the ball rolling got quite into it the game didn't seem that hard but yeah that's gonna be our playthrough thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next playthrough that we do see you later